Hello, hello, hello. How are you doing? How are you doing? Thank you guys so much for joining Tierra Thorough. I appreciate you guys clicking onto my video. This video will be for my handsome and my beautiful Scorpios out there. How y'all doing? How y'all doing? All right, this um this is a general reading, so keep in mind it's not going to resonate with everyone. So please take the part that does but doesn't leave it on out, okay? And also this could be the past, the present, or in the future, okay? So let's go ahead and get started. Scorpio, what I'm getting here is, I don't know if you guys, or this could be you, um, but you're dealing with a King of Pentacles character, okay? A Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn. I'm getting that this person here is definitely very well off, okay? Um, definitely, this could be an older gentleman, okay? Or just very wise. Or if they're young, they can have an old soul here, okay? This person here with the Ten of Cups, baby... Somebody's ready to commit. I'm getting somebody's ready to commit here. Okay. They're done being confused. Or choose, they're ready to pick out a particular love here. I'm getting like they're ready. They're ready for love. I'm getting somebody's definitely ready for love. They're tired of being single and are, and are wanting to get to you now. Okay. Or this could be you. Then we have the justice card. Wow. Libra energy. So I'm definitely getting that something is going to turn around for you guys. You're going to get justice. Things are going to balance out in this situation. So I'm getting that somebody's ready to commit to you, Scorpio. I don't know the the situation, boo. But somebody definitely is um wanting to, you know, balance things out with you. Turn things around. Yeah. So this person could have been overwhelming, okay, overboard, you know, overwhelming at times. I'm just say that. <laughs> okay. All right. Something was just very stagnant, okay. And somebody could have even considered being single, yeah. Due to let's see the ten of swords. What is the ten of swords? What is the ten of swords? Somebody's worried about some type of deception or ending. This could be an air sign for some of y'all. Who who is this? Somebody's like could be in a state of depression almost. They're unable to sleep at night. They just feel like so many things are in their mind, okay, consuming their thoughts. Or let's see. We have here a Queen of Wands. Someone that's very attractive here. Somebody very beautiful. Okay, somebody that steps in their power here. Some this is a powerful individual. This person can also be intuitive. Um, or this person is just very powerful in some particular way. A go-getter, a hustler is what I'm getting. Okay. Then we have the, the devil card and the seven of pentacles. So somebody's obsessed with this individual or obsessed with making this work. What is this? What's the devil? Or somebody could be codependent. Somebody could be, oh yeah. The Ten of Pentacles. You have the Seven of Pentacles, Ten of Pentacles, and the Devil card. So, what the hell? Somebody is, like, determined to make this work. What is this? I don't know what this is. Okay, I don't know. Somebody else feeling trapped, or I don't know. Then we have the Knight of Wands. Okay, so somebody's want to take action because somebody's actually obsessed with you. Were you obsessed with someone? But two of cups, like, uh, I guess it's a good obsession. Uh, obsession. I don't know what this is. <laughs> what the hell is this, you guys? Okay. Then we have the, the emperor. So I don't know if this is a father figure. What is this? Oh, there could be a father figure gossiping about this situation. Mm. I'm getting as though, too, there could be someone that's controlling, that's gossiping. This could be an air sign on Aries here. Um, that is concerned about this Queen of Wands and obsessed with the family that this Queen of Wands may have or what you may have. Scorpio, what the fuck is this stuff? This is crazy. What's the Emperor and the Five of Swords? This person is feeling defeated. Three of Cups. This person had you in a th third party situation. Definitely a third party situation. Or this person is teaming up with three different people or three females. But the situation is getting judged here. Okay, because these people are playing in magic. Okay, they were celebrating, they were laughing when it comes to this magic. Who's the fuck is dumb enough? I'm going to say this. I'm going to keep it real. Who the fuck dumb enough to team up with an emperor, a, 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 a nigga? He has some type of control. Was he some type of fucking pimp or something? Um, uh, To have three particular female go against this one person or this, this relationship or what have you? And these bitches fell for that shit? Like, bitch, whatever. Whatever. Then we have here... Okay, this is the twin flame situation. Typical. Because you have a connection here with someone that's strong. 
What is the Four of Wands? What is the Four of Wands? People ain't got nothing better to do. Okay, baby, anyway. <laughs> anyway, it don't matter what these motherfuckers was doing because with the magician and the will of fortune, baby, things are turning into your favor. You're going to have your union. This is going to shift. Okay, this is the truth, pure point blank. Okay. Okay, moving away from conflict. You're going to continue to move around and move away from these foes. Because they were trying to do some shit in secret, fuck up your happiness. But at the end of the day, you're going to be happy, okay? Now these people are sitting in regret. All because I'm getting a king of wands, maybe, or a fire sign. I don't know. Maybe because they want you. They wanted you. Now they feel regretful. Okay, because you may be taken. So they were doing some shit behind the scenes. Yeah, and the three of swords, heartbroken now. They were doing some shit behind the scenes, right, Scorpio? Because they wanted they wanted you. But they put they this manipulator end up manipulating three other people, three other females to plot against you and do this shit. That's cray cray. That cray cray. Okay, I'm that's all I'm gonna say. This is somebody from your past, okay? Scorpio, that is your energy, but that's somebody from your past, and this is the truth. Okay, what else? Let's go. Okay. Nine of Pentacles. Independent, single. Okay, then we have the Nine of Swords. So, so you're fighting for something, but someone's fighting for you. Or you've been fighting for your freedom away from this narc-ass motherfucker. Okay, then we have the Six of Wands, and then we have the Three of Pentacles. So it's like, regardless, you're still going to get the attention, the new love, the union. Okay, Three of Pentacles, people are going to work with you. They're admiring you, period, point blank. And some people try to go against you. Oh, and these people here, the tower, something's about to fall down on their asses, okay? They're going to be in the Four of Pentacles energy, penny pinching and shit, playing with you, okay? Yeah, Sprint Car, Leo energy, okay? So you're always going to be strong. Okay, you're always going to, you know, be humble. You see how she got that storm in the back of her? This is another obstacle that you have overcame and you're going to overcome, period. Your strength is out of this world. All you have to do is get your beauty rest and you're you're out of there. Okay, boo, please. This magic or whatever these people were trying to do is not going to work, period. Okay, so we have here, keep an open mind. So your soulmate may differ from your usual expectation and your type. Okay, somebody could be different from you, okay? I'm also getting, there could be some addictions that is involved in your romantic life. Okay, that's an issue. Then we have here, stay optimistic about your love life. So somebody needs to stay positive and have an open mind when it comes to their soulmate. New love. So new love is coming in. A new person has stirred your romantic feelings, okay? All right, you have been calling this person in. But first, you have to love on yourself if that's what you're doing now. And you have to let go of control issues. Don't try to control a situation. I'm seeing that you're very passionate about this person. You and this person might spend some time together. There's something about your religion that is different as well so somebody could be spiritual somebody else could be you know a christian what have you but i'm definitely getting two people here that's going to talk have a heart-to-heart -heart conversation okay period all right but um yeah let's see okay that we have here difficult times be on guard against chaos and unforeseen perils or emotional upheaval so control your temper for some of y'all, or something is going to end up bad, okay? So, control your temper, and also, you already know what's going on behind the scenes. You're getting your justice, you're getting your karma, so don't let nobody stir you or make you feel any type of way from your past, okay? Then we have your love life. Affairs of the heart could cause future problems, but take heart as difficult situations will be resolved by the decision this week, okay? So... And then it says, assert yourself. Go for what you want. The time is right for soulmate connections. Birth of a new child is also likely. So, y'all, control your, you know, your temper and how you speak. Okay, over this week here. All right, y'all. I love you guys so much. Y'all know where to find me. You want to add me on Instagram. You want to donate. You want a personal reading question. What have you? Look at the description box below. Love y'all. Bye.